Hello everyone, Carmine from New York here. This is photography class number 331. Let's go. As you can see, we're in a totally different location today. I am filming a video. Very rare that I film a video. Uh, I'm a photographer, not a videographer, but here's the situation. I have a long standing client who owns a store here in Midtown Manhattan. Now for spring, they want to do something crazy for their front window display. And if you're in Midtown come the spring around April 15th, you might just see the video that I'm making today in the front window. Here's what they want. The client wants a video that's going to be looped in the front window on a 77 inch UHD television. What they want is just the fish swimming by back and forth, back and forth. That's what's going to be on the video is fish swimming by, but they wanted it to fill the frame. couldn't say no. I had to do it. It's a long time client that I've been doing all of their product photography for their magazine and their website sales. Okay. So as I started to film the, in this case, the aquarium, as you notice, I'm pretty tall and the viewfinder and the screen are pretty low. So I found myself breaking my neck. So I did a little research and I came up with this gorgeous product. Guys, this is the Andy Cine 4K high brightness, five and a half inch field monitor. I found to help me make this video without breaking my neck. cost of this monitor is about $169. I am going to put a link in the description. I do not get a commission if you click that link. I just want you to go directly to see and you can see all of the highlights of the product. There's specifications that go on for pages and I am not going to read them all to you here. This is what I want to do. I just want to go over a few things with you. First of all, this is what the box looks like. Okay, it's a five and a half inch field monitor. It's the Andy Cine 4K high brightness. This is model A62. Okay, when you open the package, you get a hard shell case. In the case, you get, of course, the monitor, this removable shade for outdoors, you get the battery, which is right here. You get the cable to charge the battery. Here's the beauty part about the included battery. No separate charger required. The cable that comes with it plugs into the battery and you charge it that way. And the battery even has lights on it to show you how much charge uh, you're doing and how well you're doing on the charge. Okay. now. So it also comes with the HDMI cable, right? In this case, I have it going from the monitor into my Leica SL, which has a, an HDMI plug on the side. All right, now this is touchscreen. The monitor, this Andy Cine, five and a half inch model A62, is touchscreen incredible. All right, now I am going to put uh, a, a photograph right now of what I'm looking at. Okay. Okay. So I have a few specs that I want to give you that I find most important. All right. And hopefully you'll find it too. So it has 1600 nits N I T S. What's a nit? It's just a measure of brightness for a monitor for an indoor monitor. 500 nits is all you need. For an outdoor monitor, a thousand nits is all you need. But guys, this is 1,600 nits. 
That's how bright this monitor is. It's incredible. Okay. Uh, so it comes, like I said, with all of the cables, the bracket. Now this is a steel bracket right here. Okay. Now let's talk about the bracket. Let me put this stuff away. Here's something that I discovered. Okay. You know how cameras, uh, when you want to do vlogging, a lot of them don't have the flip up monitor so you can see uh, yourself. Check this out. You would just slide off the bracket, you turn it around, and you put it in your hot shoe this way. Now the monitor is facing forward. You can use it as a vlogging camera this way, okay, with the full screen facing you. That's and an incredible reason just to buy this screen is because it turns around and it faces you. So, all right. what's the most important so, thing right now? I want you to give me a thumbs up. I want you to comment below. I want you to subscribe. This has been Comment from New York. Bye-bye.